guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have part one of what I got for my birthday. So today I'm going to be kind of unboxing slash mini reviewing my first birthday present. So this is the Saint Laurent wallet on chain. I got this as a present for my birthday and I was totally not expecting it, but I am so obsessed with it, but I wanted to kind of unbox it for you guys here. I haven't done too many unboxings on my channel, but I figured it'd be something different, something fun, and I'm totally obsessed with the bag. I have worn it once. I did cheat. I did wear it for my seminar because I just couldn't resist. I was like dying to use it. So let's go ahead and get started. This is the box that it came in and it was purchased in store so it was purchased at Neiman Marcus most likely I'm going to be keeping the bag in this box so this is the Saint Laurent monogram metalisse leather wallet on chain this is the black on black with the black hardware which I'm so obsessed with so this bag comes in two sizes there's a small and a large this is the larger one this bag does come in a couple of different colors different hardware options there's the all black with gold hardware there's one with silver there's just so many different options but this is the all black version and I am obsessed with it I always thought I wanted to get the gold one for myself like I always thought I would buy like a YSL chain with gold hardware but I'm so happy that they ended up getting me the all black and actually when I first got the bag I started watching some reviews and I noticed that the all black is harder to get so there aren't so many available so if you do see it and you want to get it like snag it up because they don't make as many in the black on black in this box is just the price tag so this bag goes for $15.50 that's just a little price tag from Neiman Marcus and then we also have a dust bag in here which you can of course store your bag in I feel like it's a lot easier to store it in the box if you're gonna be using it quite a lot and then this is just a little card with information about the bag so that also comes in here so that's pretty much all you get in the box so now we can go into the bag so this chain is 18.5 inches and it is removable so when you open up the bag you'll see that there's an option to remove the strap so there's actually a couple of ways to wear this bag you can keep the chain on and use it just you know over your shoulder you can do it cross body I'm five feet and this bag hits me perfectly because I'm so short it just it goes and it's a petite it's a small bag so even though this is a large one it's still a small bag so it doesn't look awkward or too big or too small like I'm curvy and I'm short so I feel like this bag just hits me perfectly crossbody but I wore it mainly on my shoulder I always kind of stayed away from chain like bags on the shoulder because I always felt like they would slip off but I had no issues with this slipping off when I wore it you can also like I said remove the strap and use it as a clutch so if you're going out you know you don't want to have a chain you can just kind of hold it and remove the strap there's also a way to double up the chain and then you can have it kind of like a short bag but I wouldn't use it like that on the shoulder because then it's just literally gonna be chilling under your armpit which I'm not really a fan of or you can carry it on your hand like that but again I'm not really a fan of that look personally so for me I'm only gonna have the chain on or off either as a clutch or on my shoulder or as a crossbody if I need to have my hands free so opening up the bag it's kind of hard to see because it's all black but you do have a bunch of card slots because this is a Saint Laurent wallet on chain this is not gonna be your carry-all kind of bag obviously it's pretty small it's like an envelope style clutch kind of bag so you do have have 20 slots for credit cards, debit cards, or whatever cards you want to put in there. I think 20 is quite a lot. I don't know. I feel like I only have two cards, so and like an ID. So I don't know. I feel like they should have. I mean, I guess the more the merrier, right? Some people have a lot of credit cards, so they'll just rack those up, or maybe like loyalty cards or something like that. But for me, when I'm going out, like I really only carry one debit card and an ID. So I would probably just get a card holder. I think that's what I'm gonna purchase for myself for Christmas. Is a card holder. I'm just trying to decide like what brand to go to like I don't know if I want a Gucci a Saint Laurent I'm not sure but I do want a card holder so that it's easier for me to just take it out of this kind of bag I I just feel like putting them inside the slots when you're in a rush and you need to grab your debit card it's kind of hard to get into but nonetheless they're there and then you also have two huge open spaces you get a zipper pocket I guess for change but again for me for going out I really wouldn't carry like pocket change like change but it's there inside here we just have a little piece of paper and then 
this is just um, another little tag inside. I have an iPhone 7 Plus and it fits really nicely in that spot, right in that zipper pocket. So most likely I'll have my phone in there so that it's easier to get to. You also get a slot over here where the cards are at. You get another slot for bills. You can put money there, you can put you know little papers, little wrappers, gum, whatever you wanna do. And then you get another one of those back here. This one's a little bit tighter. Um, because it's the back of the bag. Inside it just says Saint Laurent Paris and it says made in Italy. So that's pretty much everything that's in the bag. There is no outer pocket. You really just get these spaces. So I think this bag is perfect for someone who doesn't carry much because I tried wearing it the day of my seminar and I tried to like put a lot in it because I just wanted to you know have it for the moment like I had my phone I think I had my camera even or like a selfie light and everyone kept coming up to me like close your bag close your bag and I think that's my number one gripe about this bag is that it's not a magnetic closure you actually have to snap it which is like more secure but I feel like when you're out and about and you just want to close your bag quickly it's a little bit annoying and I'm the type of person that always has like my bag open it's so bad of me like it's terrible but if I can feel what's in my bag like I'll just keep it kind of open that's just something that I've always like I've just always gone for bags that don't have zippers because I like easy access but this one I feel like is more for like a going out kind of bag maybe going to an event or for like a birthday a dinner my camera will not fit in this the Sony a5100 I tried removing the lens and putting them in but I think the Canon G7X would fit in here so I'm actually gonna try that camera out when I go to Best Buy I'm gonna see if it fits in here because I mean this is my job vlogging is my job and if I'm gonna be going to an event I need to carry my camera I can't use my phone but I'd rather have a small camera that I can fit in all of my bags nicely so that's that I'm obsessed with her like I'm totally in love with this bag I think it just looks so classy but still like badass because it's black on black like it's edgy it's not as like dainty and girly as like the silver or the gold hardware I just think she's gorgeous and it's an investment nonetheless and I'm so happy that I received this as a birthday gift I was literally in shock like I was smiling from ear to ear because it's it's just so pretty I'm so happy that it's the black on black like even though it's harder to get like it's totally worth it because I just think it looks really really classy if I was gonna get like the gold hardware then I, I'm forced to wear something that goes with that and like I think it just looks dressier where my style is more dressed down with a little bit of edge like I like wearing moto jackets and I think this looks so badass with that with jeans I think this one is totally totally wearable for any occasion where again the other ones I'm not knocking them they're gorgeous but I think they're a little bit dressier depending on the style of course for me they're a little bit too dressy because I like to just wear leggings a moto jacket and that's like the epitome of a nice outfit for me it's just like casual cool so I think this is like the perfect edgy but still girly kind of bag so that's pretty much it I just wanted to quickly show you guys and just have a moment for her on my YouTube channel because I'm literally in love with her and I think that's like the most important thing I would never want anyone or for myself to buy something and not be completely in love with it like I will stare at this bag on my shelf and just just love it so I'm on NemaMarcus.com right now this is the Saint Laurent monogram Matalise leather wallet on chain and on all black it's an envelope flat top with YSL logo lettering hidden snap closure it says the interior has a canvas lining it has two bill and 20 card slots a zip pocket two receipt compartments and it weighs one pound 2.8 ounces and the monogram is made in the USA but the bag isn't it's unavailable right now on Neiman Marcus but again this one was purchased in store yeah it says it's currently sold out and they do have a smaller one they also have the Saint Laurent monogram Kate small chain shoulder bag that one's bigger this is the wallet on chain so they're two different bags this one's like thinner which I like because it just lays on my body better so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and and if you want me to do like a what's in my bag for any of my bags, let me know. I will totally do one. I'm pretty boring when it comes to what's in my bag. So I feel like as the years go on, I'm just getting like smaller and smaller bags because my shoulders hurt sometimes. When I carry my Louis, like my shoulder takes a beating because I just stuff so much in it. So I'm like, Rose, let's downsize what we're carrying inside. Smaller bag. It's just classier. It looks better. And you don't have to kill yourself lunging around things you don't need. So this will literally just fit a phone, a card holder, or if you don't have a card holder, your cards, some cash, a lip gloss, a lipstick, and that's pretty much it. I mean, and a gum, you know, if you want some gum or like a toiletry or something like that, like you don't really need to carry much more than that. 
but if you do want to carry you know like a lot of makeup or like a camera it's it's not gonna fit in this bag so this won't be the bag for you but if you want something nice and simple you know just a couple things in your bag you don't want to be bothered this is the perfect one so that concludes my video I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in my next one bye guys